Hi, this is Steven. I'm going to show you how to use a roof in uh, Archipack. So I'm taking uh, a roof, not starting from all uh, for this sample, but usually it uh, could be simpler, easier to, to start from all. In order to make a uh, roof editing fast, you have either draft mode which is pretty fast and you can also hide covering and uh, hips while uh, while manipulating it's also uh, fast less bust, but but uh, sometimes it's enough it's a bit slower when you rotate uh, element than uh, the pure draft mode So on uh, many Archipack uh, entity you get uh, this control, which had to add, which allow to add and remove uh, the, the, the last segment. What we what we see here, we have three segments. Uh, segments are usually bound to the to the last one, so three get uh, at the end of the two and the two at the end of the one. But this order is not uh, enforced, so at some point. I want if I want to have uh, two segments coming from from the the end of the one, I can go to the free and link it to the one, so it goes here instead of uh, starting from the the segment two, which is uh, by default. So I can set up my angle here. and I add one another and four which are also linked to the one so I get something uh, neat uh, two zero and the, uh, um, the, the, the direction of a relationship between uh, between segments um, on each segment you can control either the rise or the slope or both but you will uh, lose the, the 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 way he he try to always make uh, make them fit with a uh, neighbor so if I change this one it will affect everything that is after but this one because I have I have uh, user defined uh, size on it and the same goes for the other side but this relation, uh, relationship goes uh, through the, the, the arrow so if for example I'm I'm modifying the, the segment four the waist uh, waist constraint here it will not affect in that direction but if I do the same on the on the third it will affect it. There is two ways to, to, to make uh, parts matching. Either they follow the same uh, the same size, or it's the, the, the angle between them key who is changing, which is the case uh, here. So you can see the angle change, but uh, they always fit. So keep them in auto, in uh, auto mode, and now I'm able to using the mine to get something more uh, sharp. We can also control 
the angle here in a precise way using special segments which are uh, constrained segments. Segments here are a regular one and a muse one, the, the, the five, as a slope constraint. As you can see, it defined the, the, the angle here. It's not uh, usual in it's not uh, useful in this in this case, but if I'm linking linking it to the first segment, as you can see, I'm now able to control in a precise way the angle between them while always keeping the the things uh, together. Just remove it. Now I want to add a skylight, so I do create another roof. I also use a bit more. Uh, I got either angle or a percentage for uh, for uh, for the size for the for the slope. And now I'm taking the the roof as parent and going in the four four parts and starting from the the, the start of the the, the segment. Uh, I go somewhere uh, like five meter. I'm also able to set uh, an offset in the other axis. I got a precise control over the. Over the, the the hole down the way he's cut the way parent one is cut using here the parameter so I can set both sides and the front part I also have control over the, the rotation of this, uh, this part with respect to, to the, the main one using the first one the first segment uh, rotation so if I win, want it the other side, I take it at uh, nine, minus 90 degrees. Roof also provide a cutter, which are uh, the same, uh, same entity as, uh, as many other, other Archipac objects like flooring and, uh, and slabs but uh, within roof uh, sometimes I must control the, the what, what what comes where, where I cut so here this is the segment 4 which is cutting the, the, this part so I'm gonna here on the segment 4 and I set it as a bottom part so I get uh, I get a and I may do the same thing for the segment one. When you're cutting, uh, in order to get, uh, I, can, I can show you. Uh, so now, 
I will add another cutter, but instead of a difference, I will use a union in order to get a single part. So, intersection. And now for the segment 4 here, I will set it as the top. So I get uh, I get the finish uh, that came with uh, with the top part. Side our uh, our uh, sideboard and side link will provide uh, uh, the the hips over. Linked. So I may remove this one and then update my uh, my roof. And now I can enable. You can see here the object is uh, updating. Those objects are perfectly mapped. You can wrap uh, every single uh, part. So basically, uh, using a single uh, tile-up texture, you're you're done uh, nearly out of the box. Cutter, hello. Also allow some some kind of uh, of skylights. I will make something uh, a bit smaller. Using shift, press it to and select uh, my uh, my manipulator. So. I'm able to cut any, anywhere nearly. I should just pay attention and never cutting the the the, the one polygon on two 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 parts. It uh, simply doesn't work. But making a hole, taking out a part out, is possible. And so that's it for the basic uh, of uh, roof.